Hey, hey you, do you know that one company that sells Godzilla toys for a cheap price? You you know the the company that made those Godzilla toys uh, that was exclusive for to Walmart for a little while and then a bunch of man children bought like 50 different Mecha Godzillas? Well, yeah, they're, they're still here and uh, they're doing a they did their Godzilla X Kong line and uh, I, I, I have no idea what is next. But today, what we're going to be doing is uh, we're going to be speculating on what can come next to Playmates Toys. Now, uh, very quick, if you haven't seen the movie Godzilla X Kong New Empire, there might be some spoilers in here uh, due to some different monsters that appear in that film. So just keep that in mind and let's get started. So we all know that they made their Godzilla vs. Kong line, they had the Toho line, they had a Monsterverse line, and then they had their Godzilla vs. Kong the New Empire line. What's next? Well, we already know that we're getting a 12-inch Shimu, a Roaring Shimu, a gigantic Godzilla, a gigantic Kong, a Mega Godzilla, <laughs> and a Mega Kong figure. And, um... Yeah, that's all we know for Wave 2, unless there is more, but I, I have no idea. So, is there going to be more to that r Wave 2? I have no idea. Um, will there be a Wave 3, potentially? Maybe. Maybe they'll end off with Wave 3 and then go back to their Monsterverse line. So, um, very quick, we're going to talk about the... What can come next for Godzilla X Kong the New Empire for their Playmates line? And one thing I was kind of thinking of was uh, a new a new batch of six inch figures because so far for Wave Two we haven't gotten any of our six inch figures in that Wave Two yet, unless they're that they're gonna push that to a wave three or they're just gonna stop but what can come next for a wave for a wave of six inch figures well um a godzilla a thermal blue godzilla i mean they're gonna have to push some godzilla out in there a kong without the gauntlet that is pretty likely what else well now um there are some other monsters to choose from, like that gator eel thing. I think that's what it's called. I mean, that could potentially be a thing um, to make a Playmates figure out of. I mean, they did a Warbat, so I think it would be kind of easy to do the gator eel thing, and I, I think that would be really sick. Or is it gator snake? I, I don't know. Gator, I don't know what the hell it's called. Um, but so the Gator Eel, that's what I'm just gonna call it, okay? Um, I, I I don't know if they're gonna do that. That would be really sick because that monster looked really cool. Um, we got Teamot in uh, that movie. Can we see a Teamot? That'd be really awesome. Mothra, where the hell is Mothra? Um. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure they're going to have to make a Mothra soon, at least for their Monsterverse line, so... And what I mean by Monsterverse line, I mean, like, there was a separate line from the Godzilla vs. Kong line and the GXK line, and there was one called the Monsterverse line, and that had, like, the 2014 Godzilla figure and, like, the Ghidorah. So, maybe they were going to push those towards the the Monsterverse line instead of the GXK line, but, um, also Scylla. I mean, I think that would be the hardest one to make, right? I mean, we did get a leak for Warp Dog to get a Playmates figure. Maybe they're gonna do a little, um, Playmates, uh, thing, like what they did with Suko and include another monster, like Warp Dog and then a Hellhawk from GXK. I think that would be pretty cool. I think it would be cool to get a Hellhawk figure in general. I mean, screw it, why not? I think Playmates is the best ones to do those. And 
stuff. Uh, Jesus. Um, and then also two packs. Where, where the hell is the two packs? Um, I think a if they make a Scylla, it would be cool to get a Godzilla versus Scylla in Rome. That would be really cool. And then maybe a Kong versus Gator Eel, whatever the hell that thing is called. Um, I think that would also be a pretty cool set. Um, and yeah, I, I think those are potentially some stuff we could get. Also, a Mega Shimu and a Mega Scar King. I don't think we're gonna get a gigantic Scar King and a gigantic Shimu. I, I really don't think we're gonna get those. But I do think we could get a Mega Kong and then or a Mega Scar King and then a Mega Shimu. I think that would be pretty cool. Um, so going with Monsterverse, um, where the hell? Like, yeah, again, we still need more two packs. Like. And, you know, they could do anything throughout the Monsterverse. They could do a San Francisco 2014 versus Muto. Or a Mothra versus Rodan. Um, a Godzilla versus Ghidorah. Like an ice type of set. Um, you know, that Hollow Earth set with Godzilla and Kong. That should have been a Kong and... Warbat set. I mean, come on. Maybe a mech or, or a Kong versus Skullcrawler in Skull Island. Like, I think that would be great to just see more of those those packs instead of just getting them with Godzilla and Kong. And just, yeah, I, I'd love to see the future of that. Um, they're six inch figures. I'm, we're probably going to see a Rodan, a Mothra, hopefully a Muto, maybe a re release of a Skullcrawler. Um, so, yeah, I, I hope we get to see those. And some, like, other monsters from 2019, like Behemoth and... Methu well, Methuselah is kind of hard because of the feet. Apparently, uh, the companies that can do monsters figures can't make a Methuselah because it's an unfinished model, which... Why not just give the companies that are making these figures, like, some creativity on working on the feet. I don't know how hard that would be. Um, but, yeah. Some monsters like that. I, I hope we see more in that monsters line. Now, one thing... Oh, wait, and also, a Mega Mecha Godzilla. We got that leak, like, a year or two before GVK. We got a me Mecha... Wait, a Mega Mecha Godzilla. And we never got that ever and i don't know when they're gonna release that they did say that they were uh i, I think this is in loomis uh video so you can go check him out um but he made a video where he uh was talking about uh where the mega mecha godzilla could be and they said that they're strictly working on godzilla x kong the new empire for you know and that's, you know, totally fine. And they s stopped with the Toho figures, the Toho line, because the Toho Classic line, because their Monsterverse figures just sold way better. And um, maybe they're going to go back to that after they're done with their Godzilla X Kong, the new Empire figures. Maybe they'll come back and do that. I really hope so, because... It was so awesome having a Baragon, a Gorosaurus, a Rodan, a uh, a J Jaguar in stores, and that was just awesome. I mean, back when I was young, we had like Bandai Creation, we had the Fusion series figures, we had a Burning Godzilla, a Rainbow Mothra, King Caesar and then Mecha Godzilla, but there was only a few characters that you could get at the time. Like back then, you couldn't even find a King Kong figure. Like it was that hard in stores, you know. And uh, I'm really hoping uh, we get more uh, of the Toho Classic line because I really miss that line. Uh, we were supposed to get a 75 Godzilla from the leaks. There was apparently going to be a 75 God, uh, Godzilla, and we never got that, which sucks, because that would have been really cool. Um, and then, uh, 
there was more other monsters that they were supposed to create. I'm pretty sure the next character was going to be Megalon. I, I'm, I feel like they were set to just for their next two figures, 75 Godzilla and then Megalon. I, I feel like those were going to be the next two, but they never did that. And now we're just getting Godzilla's Kong figures. So, what do you think? And what do you want Playmates to make in the future? Um, I want them to make good figures. And they have. And that's really awesome. Also, do you think they're going to ditch the battle damage stuff fully? Let me know what you think about that in the comments. I hope you liked this video. Uh, I did hand select some videos for you guys. It's a series called, called Kaijun Friends. So, I hope you enjoy that. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.